everybody. Today I would like to speak about 2211. Two Shui points. Two is earth and Shui is water. From the name of this acupuncture point, we can understand that this point deals with water and earth, meaning that this point treat dampness, treat spleen and kidney imbalance. Lung ten area. It is a three set point in the area of lung ten. The middle one is lung ten. The first two shui e is half a tune distal to lung ten, and two shui san is half a tune proximal to lung. 10. So, from a mirroring point of view, we can look at our thumb and think that the thumb is mirroring for my entire leg. So, the upper part of the thumb is my thigh, where this area here, the metacarpal phalangeal junction, is my knee. So, one of the functions of Tushwe is to treat sciatical pain. Since we can understand, here, we can understand that this area is my thigh. Okay? So, it can treat sciatical pain, it can treat knee pain, and also lower back pain. Another part of imaging is to think that the thumb is my head. So, the area of lung 10, the whole area, is my chest. So, Treating the area here can help to treat, let's say, cough, let's say sore throat, okay, which is in the area between my head and my chest. From the name of this point, Tushwe, we understand that the reaction area of the point is the spleen and the kidney. And from this, we understand the pathology that is needed in order to use these points, which is dampness, cold dampness. When do we have cold dampness situations? So the first thing that I recall is using Tushui 2211 in diarrhea. Diarrhea is often combined with dampness. So when I think of treating 2211, I combine it usually with the four flowers on the Yang Ming stomach channel in the leg. Another option to treat is stomach pain using Lingu and Da Bai as a combination to ease the pain. In gynecology, when we see Loikorea, we can think also for Tushwe. Tushwe will treat the dampness in the lower jaw. Okay? Again, from a mirroring point of view, this hand, this place is the leg. The leg and the lower jaw. So, treating Tushwe can help with Loikorea we can think to add the Dauma 3310 and also Win Bai and Li Bai points which are next to the deltoid. So 
Too straight is an important point for using to clear and drain dampness and the indication for that can be diarrhea, can be stomach problems, can be lung, so throat, so the tie-in is involved. And from a gynecology point of view, vaginal discharge is one of the indications. So how do we puncture? We need to locate the area of lung 10. We are talking about the metacarpal bone, the first one. So in the middle, we locate, and this will be the middle point. Half a zoom, 5 fen distal, will be tu shui e. Lang ten is tu shui r. And half a zoom, 5 fen proximal, will be tu shui san. So when we puncture, we first locate the middle point. And we puncture, we needle. Tu shui e will be half a zone distally, and tu shui san is half a zone. Approximately. The needle is half a tsun till one tsun deep and we puncture it towards the area of 2201 and 2202. So this is Tu Shui E, R and Sun. 2211.